Hey everyone, my name is Mahalo and I'm going to show you how to create your event on Invited. So we're going to create the Wine Machine event here. First things first, important to add Wine Machine photo. Next up, I'm going to add in the title, what time it starts. So this one I'm going to go off the Swan Valley event, which I understand to be on Saturday the 26th of November at 1pm. You can add in an end date and time if you'd like. So I'm just going to assume that it ends around 11 p.m. Um, and it's happening at Oakover Grounds in Middle Swan. Perfect, you can add in your own event link. So this one would be for ticketing. So let me pull up the Wine Machine ticketing link and also the description. So this one found online, perfect. That's the description. And this is your Wine Machine event created. Just like that. First things first, you can invite whoever you want. So I'm on desktop, so it gives me the options of Facebook, Twitter, email, um, or I can alternatively just copy the link. But I'll show you what it looks like on mobile phone. Because if you decide to use mobile and your promoters decide to use mobile, um, then they can share it to Snapchat, Instagram, WhatsApp, whatever that, that they want, including stories added as a hyperlink in there, they can share it through there. Going back to the Wine Machine event, um, the next feature I want to show you is called the Text Guest feature. So here, everybody who responds to your event, you can actually communicate with by texting them directly. So you can text those people who are going as well as can't go or respond later or any combination that you want in there. And you can just send them any updates that they need to know for your event. Um, finally, here is the guest list. So at the moment, it's just myself, but as more people respond to the event, you'll see that guest list change. Um, and when we go into this part of it, you can see I can download the event straight to my calendar and save it in there. This is what it looks like. It's got all the event details already on there. Just save and close that. The location, when I click that, it opens up Google Maps. It'll do this on phone as well as on desktop, which is fantastic so people know how to get there. Um, as well as this link for your ticketing, opens it up very quickly so people can actually purchase the ticket through there. You'll be able to see exactly who's going. Um, we can get you the information that you want on them if it's their phone numbers as well, and you can stay in contact. Finally here, you can add in your own comment or other people can comment for you on there. And when you go into your event settings, you can choose whether or not you want to make that invite button public. I assume this is a public event, so you want to keep it public. And if you want to keep that guest list shown for other people to see who's going. Uh, and that's invited. Super simple. It's cross-platform events. The way I like to put it is Facebook events without Facebook. Um, and we really made it so that people would be able to promote their event across any social media network. Thanks.